Now the very last thing I would ask you to do as part of your experiences of digital technologies is to complete some feedback. Now formally the university has the um, set and sec um, evaluations, student evaluation of courses, student evaluation of teaching. And they're very useful for us in terms of measures of our own performance. And I would very much hope that you will provide positive feedback around your experiences in this course through those mechanisms. Of course, they are very useful for us in our evaluations of our own um, teaching and academic performance. Now, of course, I do still want to hear about any negative aspects of the course that you've had. And to provide you with a mechanism of that, which doesn't necessarily impact upon the set and sex scores, I've provided you with an online form that is still anonymous, and it allows you an opportunity to provide any negative critical feedback that you feel is um, useful and that you wish to make about the course or about my teaching or about any other aspect that relates to anything I've got any control over. Um, so please use that mechanism to provide negative feedback. Still do it respectfully. It's not an opportunity to be cruel or mean. I understand there is a power differential that we have. I am conducting assessments on you and you may feel that my assessments don't necessarily reflect your true capabilities. I try to be as fair as I possibly can in all of my assessments and provide you with feedback that you can utilize to improve yourself. But I understand fully that sometimes that will be different to how you feel you deserve to have received various marks and grades. That is a nature of teaching and you will, for better or for worse, experience, experience that yourself as teachers and going through the assessment process from the teacher side of things. But please provide um, honest and useful feedback that I can utilize to improve the courses. Through the set and sec, please provide positive um, feedback that can be useful for other mechanisms, but for improvement of the course and improvement of my own teaching, if there is advice that you can provide, I do welcome you to provide that through this online form. And that brings us to the end. I hope you've enjoyed the course. I've of course enjoyed um, giving it. It's the reason I stepped out of um, K-12 teaching and into university teaching to have the opportunity to help guide you and to improve the teacher education processes for digital technologies teachers. I trust that we will meet again at various times during your career at various um, professional opportunities, either through professional development or through conferences or research that I conduct in schools. And I do hope that you'll say hi and we can reminisce on your experiences during this course and how it may have helped you or otherwise um, in preparation for your career as teachers. And I'll just leave you with a final poem that reminds you that all of these aspects are important around curriculum and around um, assessment and all the rest, but they're not as important as being engaged with learning and curiosity and creativity and all of those that you bring to teaching. So always remember that you are the professional as a teacher. Take on board what others tell you about curriculum guidance and pedagogical guidance and all of the rest. But in the end, it comes down to you and your decisions. You are the teacher and you are the one that makes the final say in guiding your students in their learning. And no one can take that away from you, regardless of how much some people may try. So all the best with your future teaching careers. I hope to see some of you again in digital solutions. And if not, I'll see you again as teachers.